a recap of a lesson I did earlier today, which was to play Nobody Knows You When You're Down and Out by Eric Clapton from his Unplugged album. So I'm just going to run through the chords again so you've got them. Uh, it's the same progression pretty much all the way through. So once you've got these chords locked in, you will be okay. So your first chord is a C. Your next chord is E7. So get used to doing those two moves. Now what you could just look at here, we've got your C chord. Your second and index fingers can just literally move up. Give me that E7. Then we're going to change to an A7, that's an A chord. Then an A7. In this instance, I'm playing the A as your normal A. And I'm going to bring my little finger in to give me that third fret on the high E, which is the note of G, which is the seventh of A. Minus a D minor. I've noticed that I did the A7 this time with the open G string. Just to my ear, it sounds less jarring than going. Then from that D minor, we're going to change to an F chord. Now, what I would recommend doing is totally up to you, but you can just leave your second finger on the G string here. Um, your first finger is kind of in place, so you can just move that across to get the B and E strings and then bring your third finger up. You've got a nice easy transition. The next chord up is F sharp to minus 7. My middle finger has stayed exactly where it was. What's happened is my index finger has slid from there up as far as the D string and I've brought my third finger in to be on the second fret on the high E. So we just take that D minor to the F to the F sharp diminished seven to a C to an A seven D seven to a G seven. So C, E7, A, A7, D minor, A7, back to D minor, F, F sharp to minish 7, C, Now there's one little bit I just did there that I haven't mentioned, which is when it's the change from the C to the A7. I did a little walk down. I went, which is to play the C chord, and then on the A string, just play third fret, second fret, first fret, and then move it to the A7. So you A C B A sharp or B flat A depends on your perspective in this instance. Now, for the exception of uh, one of the D minor chords, the D seven chord, and the G seven chord, everything is really a two B kind of deal. So you're going to get this kind of. Um, Just does that all the way through. The only thing that changes ever so slightly is at the very end of the song, you've got that as an ending, which is a B9 chord, slid into a C9 chord. It's really the only thing that's any different. So 
Crack away at that and see how you get on with. Nobody knows you when you're down and out by Eric Clapton from his Unplugged album.